Oh, hello, and welcome back to my channel. This is the family cookbook made by my sister, or should I rather say compiled by my sister. It holds all the secret recipes of our family. Anything from how to make meat braise, to cookies, to puddings, to anything that's been tried and tested. And what happened was that we decided to go off book to make fudge. Now the recipe that we found was online, so we tried to give it a go. What resulted was not fudge at first. So stay tuned and I will show you how to make toffee and then fudge. How to correct a disaster. Enjoy. Hi guys, subscribe to my channel now so that you do not forget. Hit that bell icon and get notified of my further uploads. Lastly, feel free to comment. Show me some love by giving me a thumbs up at the end of the video. Okay, first off ingredients. 150 gram butter. One, condensed milk. That's about 38 grams. A vanilla essence, 5 ml. Brown sugar, 500 grams. And 125 ml milk. And a heavy bottom pot. This is the one that I use. So the first thing that we do is we got the butter and we added the butter up to 150 grams. Yeah, scoop the butter in the pot. Easy, easy. Next up is the brown sugar. You need to add 500 grams of brown sugar. We just didn't have enough space in this little container, so we put in about 450 and the rest afterwards. But it's a total of 500 grams. Just look at that. At the moment, the oven is set to a highest setting. But once it starts uh, melting and boiling, you have to put it down on medium to low heat. Next we're going to add 125 ml milk. As you can see, the butter and the sugar is starting to melt. And it almost looks like chicken pieces in soup, doesn't it? So let's quickly fix that. We still need to add some ingredients. Next up will be the condensed milk. One can. As you can see at this point, the oven is set to medium heat. Don't forget to keep stirring or else the mix will burn to the pot. Or the mix will burn, that's what they told me. Just stir. Next up is 5 ml vanilla essence. And then the fun really starts. Now you start stirring and you stir that pot for 20 minutes on medium heat. After your 20 minutes, spend another 5 minutes on a cold plate. There we go, that's the end of the mix. 
and also the disaster. It turns out we actually made toffee because our first mistake was that we didn't stir it for 20 minutes. We stirred it for 15 minutes and then for 5 minutes on a cold plate and it turns out 15 minutes is not enough. So how did we fix it? Well, the next morning the wife took the taffy or toffee and she scooped it into a fresh batch that she made. So we went through all the ingredients again, made another batch and then she took the taffy and added it to the new batch. Again, at a medium heat, she waited until everything melted nicely in one. And then you start the stirring again. And you stir for another 20 minutes on a warm plate or medium heat plate. And then 5 minutes on a cold plate. Just look at that. That's what it should look like after 20 minutes on a warm plate. Now, you just stir it for the next 5 minutes on a cold plate. Once you're done, pour everything into your pan which has been pre-prepared. You can either put some paper underneath or you can use spray and cook and spray your pan nice and thick. Pour all the fudge into the pan and then let it sit in the fridge for about 4 hours. And there we go guys, there's the fudge at the end of the day. So thanks for watching this channel, thanks for watching this video. Remember to subscribe to my channel and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. And uh, if you want to see more content like this, then remember to hit that bell icon so that you can get notified of any of my further uploads. Until next time, cheers.